Hello everybody, this is me, my unboxings and fun here today. Today I'll be having an unboxing video and a review of the Hatch Mouse Surprise Toys. Now I got this toy from Amazon.co.uk and I've actually pre-ordered it about a week ago and I received it today, which I'm very happy about. Uh, as you can see, this is the new version, which is Hatch Mouse Surprise and it's obviously the twins version, so you get two uh, in an egg. And obviously, you don't know who you will hatch, um, as it says at the bottom there. So again, as I told you, there are two possibilities. I'm going to show you that there. There are two possibilities. You can either get these ones, or you can get these ones to hatch. But again, everyone's egg is different. You don't, you know, you don't really know which one to hatch. And as you can see, the egg is actually right here. It feels very fragile. Actually, not very fragile. It feels very, uh, actually, very strong. Actually, <laughs> I should say. Uh, at the back, it says hold, so you can actually like feel it and stuff, uh, and get like it's the heat and stuff of it. Uh, here it has. Uh, it says hatch, and then obviously you play with it, and it obviously grows up from a baby to an adult. So you can see that that, that kind of life cycle of the actual toy. I actually don't know what happens after. Like, does it die after? Or is it like a Tamagotchi? Or I don't know. But it's a pretty cool toy. And I think, you know, last year I remember when the Hatch Mouse came out during Christmas time. It was a big, big thing. And these are the things. It was a big, big thing. You know, it was sold out. In, I, I was gonna, I was planning to get it and make a video on it. But it was sold out everywhere during Christmas. So thankfully I got this uh, today. And I there's no doubt that this will also be a big hit during Christmas. But who knows. So I'm just going to actually open the box now again. Uh, I've never opened this before. As you can see, because the egg hasn't, I mean, hasn't hatched yet as well. There's two um, set of tapes there. I'm just going to take that off. Okay, I'm just going to remove that. Okay, remove it very, very carefully. In case I break the egg in a way. Oh, that, I told you I'm going to break the egg in a way. If it, if I open it carefully. And this part here. I don't have my unboxing knife, unfortunately. So, yeah. Oh, that's a fake part of the egg. Okay, so the real egg is actually in the in the actual box, I guess. That's strange, I don't actually know that, but yeah. The real egg is in the actual box. I'm just gonna remove that part there. So as you can see, there's nothing else in the box. The box is totally empty. I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna put it to the side and put this behind here. Yeah, uh, and this is the actual egg, as you can see. I'm just gonna stand it up like that. That's the actual egg, and what I'm going to do is I will be taking this compartment out here. Well, I can actually just take okay, the compartment out first. Take the egg out first, more like. Um, and then, obviously, there's more sort of sellotapes you have to take off, so I'll just take that off now. And here. I mean, it's very secure, so there won't be any problems with the actual egg breaking or anything like that. It's pretty cool. Okay, this is the egg right here, as you can see. And as soon as I think, as I remove these straps, it will start waking up. So I'm just actually going to do that now. But I don't know how to do that. It says, after remove, look what it says. I don't know what it says, but let's see what it says. It says, I don't know if you can see that. So it says, after removal, dispense the key locks immediately. Okay, so, and it gives me just two indication arrows about to turn. So it says turn here, turn here, remove, and then... So, oh, you can actually see it already. It's pretty... I'm just going to leave it here. Okay, well, I'll continue with some boxing. So keep your eyes on that if you want to see that hatching and talking at the same time. But uh, I'm going to actually open the box first and see this first. So I'm just going to show you this first. So just keep an eye on that, guys, if you want to see that. But uh, I'm actually going to show you what's inside the box. So I'm just going to put everything else inside the box and gone. So again, box it. Oh, I'm just gonna... the box is going to... Yeah, okay. Uh, so this is the actual manuals we get in the box. So I'm just going to take that apart and you can see what we get inside the box in terms of the manual. So it says here, uh, the customer service team is right here. So you can see, you know, if you need any problems or anything, then um, you have to obviously talk to these people here. So for example, if the egg wasn't in the box or if the egg was broken or whatever, you have to talk to those people there. And a bunch of different manuals in different languages to see, to show you which type of um, uh, possibilities you can get. Again, nothing intriguing, but that's that. Uh, again, I don't know why they waste all their ink doing this, they should do it per country, 
but they have again a bunch of other manuals where you can look at and let me see what the British manual is or the English instructions easy to follow instructions okay. so this is one here okay so you can see easy to follow instructions um, there so two hatching miles in one egg one hatching mile egg one cheat sheet one instruction guide so the, the sheets that I would just that I just put to the side these are actually cheat sheets so you can actually see how to hatch the egg which I can't find in English for some reason um, where the hell is English okay I don't think there's English in here we don't, we don't even need the cheat sheet anyway so forget about that um, then one instruction guide which I have in my hand here it already had the battery in it so you don't have to worry about any batteries I think I'm hatching while sleeping wait Stage one pre-hatch, tilt or tap or touch the interrupt of your egg. So you have to touch it, tap it, hold around the bottom of your egg to hear the heartbeats or to warm us up. So you can hear the heartbeat by putting your hand at the bottom of it. Let me just wake it up. So apparently you can hear the heartbeat of the egg, which I can kind of hear. Tilt the egg to play with it. So I'm, til I'm tilting it, as you can see. Let me shake it. One eternity later. They wake it right up, probably killing the egg. I actually do not do this in real life egg guys, like if you have a like a chicken egg or something, don't actually do this in egg. This is just a toy, so that's why I'm just showing this for illustration purposes, but I think it takes a time for it hatch, so just leave it, leave it there. I'm actually rubbing the bottom. So as you can see guys, um, the top part has hatched. So I'm not going to hatch it, I just want to see how it comes out. Uh, Yeah, so the top part has hatched, as you can see. Okay, I think you have to continue rubbing it. So you can see how it is, the boat, the, the egg, it's like a plasticky sort of thing. Wow. Maybe if you stop rubbing it. You have to stop, continue rubbing it. Ah.
Okay, it's very nice. The ink's like a removed now, I think. Yeah. Clean. So as you can see guys, this is the egg. It's empty now. This one took out. So this is the egg. As you can see, oh, the egg. As you can see. So you can see you can interact with it, you can play with it. So that's pretty much it basically. Uh, so that's pretty much the basics of the toy. Um, you can play with it, you can raise it up. So it's a baby at the moment, it will grow up into an adult. And then from an adult, I don't know where we'll go from that. But you can raise it like a Tamagotchi basically. So it's actually a physical sort of Tamagotchi from an egg, physical egg, to a physical toy. So again guys, I think it's a pretty, pretty good uh, creation. Um, I think it doesn't know that the egg hasn't been hatched yet, but it has been hatched. Uh, because the mechanism still has to like go in here. But it's fine, so yeah. So uh, you're hatched now. Right, you're hatched. Okay, I just want to let you know you're hatched. Okay, um... Yeah, so that's the toy as you can see guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, so it's pretty much, one of them looks like, you know, one of them has like a retractable head. One of them has a retractable head as you can see. One of them has a stiff head, okay. At the bottom of it you can see this is where the actual mechanics get into place. So this is where the actual rotation gets into. So you can see, and this is what actually breaks the egg. So it's pretty cool in how it works. Uh, this is how you replace the battery. At the bottom, the tail, which you can't do anything with. And then you have two eyes which just light up. There's not really a special thing about the eyes. It's not like a Furby sort of thing. So what Hachimans could have actually done, they could have actually made the price at about £150. And they could have added Furby-like eyes to their eyes to make it more realistic and make them move. Make them have more, you know, facial expressions because that's what I think is lacking. Um, and this one is just like a plain little thing. So it's pretty cool, I mean, it's not, I'm not saying it's really, it's rubbish, but it's a pretty cool toy to have, especially for young kids. And, it's, and obviously for Christmas as well, it would be a great, great addition uh, to your toy collection. So again, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, in, okay, they're really excited now. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, uh, of the Hatchimals, um, surprise twins. And the one that I got was two of the same twins, it seems like. So have a nice day, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my box and fun for more of these videos. And I will catch you all later with my new unboxing, which will be on a tablet. So stay tuned to my channel for more videos on that. Have a nice day, guys. Subscribe to my, my unboxing fun. And goodbye.